Welcome back, lovelies. Today's video is one that I have literally been watching the mail. This was supposed to arrive last week. So it's a little bit late from what the tracking says. At least it said it was supposed to arrive. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I do know it's late. It was supposed to arrive last week sometime. But either way, I don't care. I'm very happy. You already know by the thumbnail. Yes. So, that is what we're going to be looking at today. Look how cute my shirt is. I know, right? It's very comfy. It's actually a night shirt. And I have the night pants on to match. I've had this set for two years now, I think. I got it from Walmart. It's so comfortable and I love it. That is what I'm filming in because I want to be comfy. Because it is 30 degrees. 30 degrees today, which is why you hear no air, and I'm so here for it. Also, wow, they're still on. Very cute. I love them. Look, how cute are they? Sorry, look at this. Do you see if I put my hands down, this one, how the pinky goes under? I have broken, I think, 12 bones altogether. Yeah, I've broken a lot of bones. My pinky, all of these fingers, minus the thumb when this hand has been broke at one time, at the same time. That's another thing for another video. But let's get into this. If you would like to see my Color Pop Nightmare Before Christmas collection, I'm so excited if you can't tell, then please consider subscribing down below. Ring that bell so you know when the next video comes. And because I'm always doing giveaways and there's one going on right now, there's actually two going on right now. The Color Pop plush like the entire collection and a Jeffree Star giveaway out of his new boxes. And if you enjoy this, please leave me a like down there. It does help. And comment. Comment anything you'd like down below. Liking my video and commenting and sharing is the quickest way for us to grow. And we are growing very quickly. So some of you are doing that. But I'm going to shut the hell up now. And we're going to get into this video. So I'm going to take everything out. But really quick. Please don't fall. Nothing fall. There's what everything looks like. I know, right? Let me take everything out. Okay, I've got everything out. Now, I want to tell you guys something. You can get this entire collection for $115, okay? But, but right now, they have a sale going on. You spend so much, you get so much off. You spend $100, you get $25 off. So if you bought this entire collection for $115, you would get $25 off. So you would get it for $90. 90. That, that, that's pretty good. But I just thought I would tell you that in case there's anything you like. And I'm also going to tell you what each thing would cost individually. So let's get into it. Where do we start? I love these nails. Like, these are my kiss nails that I got. Like, they long. And they are not, like, ow. They're sharp. And I even rounded off the edges. The edges. The ends a little bit. Now, let's start with the crystals. These are the Tim Burton Nightmare Before Christmas individual crystal sheet. There are 72 different colored crystals. They're very, very cute. Now, you could buy these by themselves for $8. Let me open them. Like, can we look at this packaging? Oh my gosh. It feels, listen. It feels like that very soft matte that you get on the Jeffree Star soft touch mirrors. Love that. Anyways, here they are. I'm trying to keep the glare, as you see, off. But it looks like we have, like this row look, these two rows right here look pink. These two look like an orange. These look like a hot pink. And then obviously those look purple blue. But they all look iridescent. I think it's AB. I'm not a crystal expert. I think it's... Did you see that one piece of hair? Driving me nuts. I think they're AB is what they'd be called because of how they reflect the light. But no, me, I'm probably wrong. But how pretty are those? And they are self-adhesive, so they're stickers. You just pull them off, stick them on your face, your nails, whatever. So we got those. Next, we'll go into the liners. This is... Y'all, I'm blind as hell. This is the BFF Liquid Liner. 
I think it's green queen is the color, but just give it a moment. Look at this packaging. Look at Sally living her best life. As you can see, there's glitter. Listen, there is glitter. It never fails. The damn cars. Anyways, back to this. You can see the glitter, skulls and snowflakes. And it does say Nightmare Before Christmas, Tim Burton, Disney. But like, look at Sally in all pink. Sorry, but I can't help myself. I am, I am living my inner child right now. So we're going to look at all the packaging. So if you don't like that, sorry. It's so pretty. I don't know why I'm whispering. Look at this. And this one is black. Look at that point. Like, I'm gonna make a thicker line and a thinner one. Okay, we'll see if it dries matte or shiny. And it is the spring loaded, so you don't mess up your pen. So we have that. Now you can buy these individually for $10 if you don't wanna buy the whole set. And then next we have Pumpkin King. So we have Jack. Like, you know, I know ColourPop, they be popping out. Anyways, they pop out a lot of collections very quickly. But they did not disappoint on this one. They took into every accountability for the details on everything. And I'm loving it. So, Jack's is white. So I'm guessing... His would be white, but like hers was pink detail and it was black, whatever. Um, yes, it's white. So we'll do the same. Thick, thin. Ooh. It is, it is not completely matte. Do you see? It is matte, but like, oh, it's not showing on camera. But in real life, it has a sheen when the light hits it that makes it look more like kind of like satin, I would say. So we have both of those and you can buy those for $10 each. So 20 for the set. 20 for the set, you add $70 and you get everything. Just, I know 70 is a lot. It's not like it's just a couple pennies. But I'm just saying, don't come for me. Don't kill me. Okay. This packaging. I can't. Now this is the glitter. This is $10 by itself, but you cannot buy this unless you buy the set. This is the only thing that sold out. Go figure that the only thing that sold out was the glitter, but hey. Now let's take a moment. This is, listen, all the snowflake looking pieces are covered in glitter. I'm trying to get the light to reflect them. Look at this one. Okay. You see it there, it says, color pop and it's got that it's a glitter and blah 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 and there's glitter all over the box but it doesn't come off like how cute i swear whenever i record there's cars and helicopters and everything but before i started recording it was quiet like why but anyways like i said this is sold out you cannot buy this and i love how it's asymmetrical like, do you see how nothing is even. Let me tell you something. My OCD, I'm all about things being even, but I'm feeling this just because. Oh my gosh. Look at the inside. We have the doctor. We have Jack. We have Lock, Shock, and Barrel. The mayor. Ah, I love it. I am hating breaking down this packaging. I ain't gonna lie. I actually might cut some of this up and put it in my scrapbook. Start junk journaling. Look at this. Maybe I maybe I know why it's sold out now. Come on, look at Jack. I just love it so much. Packaging is all black, but you could see all the iridescent glitter. Or hollow, maybe. I don't know. You have your cap. There's a damn helicopter. I have tried to outweigh it, but I can't anymore.
So I'm sorry about the helicopter. Here's what it looks like. I don't know if it's hollow or not, but let's swatch. Can you see it better now? Yes, look at that. I spread it on the lid. Patting it on works the best. Don't swipe. I'm trying to get it nice and thick. And then I'm gonna swipe a little bit over here, make it thinner so maybe you can actually see the shapes and things. It looks like there are no shapes. What am I talking about? Okay. Okay, so here we go. By the way, the name of this is Mother of Fright. And here's what it looks like. I don't want you to see my face. I wanted to try and focus. Look at all the colors. Now you can see the fallout down here. It just has, there's lots of iridescent shards in there. And it's got like a, I would say, I don't know. I think it's like a clear slash white with like a hint of purple base. I know that's a weird combination, but okay. That is Mother of Fright, the glitter. And like I said, this would be $10 by itself, but this is the only thing that's sold out. Like, why do they have to be doing that when I start recording? Why? Okay, next. Oh, this must be the sponge. I'm like, why is it so empty? This is the sponge. This is in stock. You could buy this by itself for $8. This is zero and his the sponge they made for him. I love zero. This will be my first ColourPop sponge, believe it or not. Same packaging on the inside. know if you guys do you see the glitter did I do that I think I did that did I I don't know if I did that or if it came with glitter because the only glitter I have is those couple big chunky ones does this come with glitter Either way, this is the Zero Detailed Blending Sponge. I don't know if it comes with the glitter or not, but look at him. And this is very nice. Like, it's firm, but it's still, it's not too firm, but it's firm enough that I don't think it's one of them sponges that are going to soak up all of your foundation and products because it's so firm. Like, it's squidgy. Oh, my gosh. I could just use this as a squishy that's how nice it feels. And it feels like um, a velvet sponge. You know what I mean? The ones that are make, it, make your makeup blurred. That's what this feels like. This is very nice. I just still can't tell if it came with the glitter. I think it did. Anyways, there is that. And like I said, this is $8. You can buy this. Let's get into this. Now, this trio is available right now for $28. Or you can buy each of the three in there for $10 if you don't want all three of them. So let's do the packaging check. Lock, shock, and barrel. My son, I bought him um, for Christmas last year. They're like plaques that have each of their masks in them from Hot Topic. And they look, they were not cheap. But they looked amazing. Because he likes lock, shock, and barrel. He has that mask right there. The year before last year not this Halloween but the one before that was his costume but either way it does have the glittery stars look how good that looks this is the jelly much shadow trio and I look now let me tell you something I haven't watched any videos reviewing this but I love their jelly much shadows ever since I got my first one a few months back so I know I'm gonna love these already. And again, this is $28 for the set, or you can buy them separately for 10. It is so freaking cute, look at it, you guys. 
I am, I am living my life right now. I'm so happy. Oh. I don't know. That was just satisfying to me. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and start. We're going to start with lock. Look at lock. Hold on. I'm getting glitter everywhere. Like, I'm probably going to keep this, like, and it's got that matte feel. I'm probably going to keep this, put, like, earrings or something in it. Shoot. Anyways, back to lock. There's lock. It says it on the back. Let's see what lock looks like. And I got these damn nails. Okay, here's what lock looks like. So we'll go ahead and swatch off the lid. It'll be easier for me with these nails. And these ain't even nails, these are talons. Oh, do you see that? Okay. That is beautiful. If you use the, oh my gosh, it's not coming on camera, coming off on camera like in real life. In real life, it goes from black. See the black over there? And it looks blue to you guys, but it is not. It is a deep purple. I gotta figure out, maybe it'll show. No, it still looks blue. I gotta figure out how to get this fixed with the lighting. Like I've got all my lights on natural. I've tried them on cool. I've tried them on warm. Nothing works. Okay guys, since it looks blue, when it should look purple, I am going to insert a little clip where I took a video and messed with the color and the warmth so you guys could see the actual color. I'll insert it now. Okay, let's look at shock. Oh, shock is a pink. Why is shock? Shouldn't shock be green? I, whatever. I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm guessing they're pulling pink, like, you know, see how it's pink? I'm trying to pull all the colors together. There is shock. Show you the lid, maybe it, no, it doesn't help. Here is shock. Let me fix that little glob. It doesn't take much, and I was getting globs. So this doesn't change colors. This is just a pink. A very fluorescent neon pink. And it looks exactly in real life like you're seeing it. So that is shock. And last, but most definitely not least, we have barrel. Barrel's my favorite, honestly. Here's the back. Hmm, I can't tell what barrel is. It copper or brown. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that shift. You could, hold on. It goes from like gold to bronze. Oh. It's not gold though. It's like a, like a greeny gold. If that makes any sense. Shift's not really, oh, it looks nothing like that in real life. So we'll have to insert another clip and I'll mess with the coloring. Here is barrel. Hopefully the shift will show better. Let me get a little bit more. I didn't get as much with barrel as the other two, but I probably should have. Look at that shift. There you go. You can see like that bronzy copper into like that greeny gold. No, it shows on camera now. That's exactly what it looks like. But it didn't before. It just looked gold. Look at the difference. There's like that copper and then the shift. 
So it's pretty funny. Barrow is my favorite character, and Barrow is my favorite color. So we have a duochrome for Barrow. We have a duochrome for Locke. But then they just kind of like said screw shock and just gave him a plain pink. How unfair is that? But that's okay. So we have lock, shock, and barrel. Okay. So that was the three trios. Again, that is 28 or 10 each. How cute. Come on, Boogie. How cute are these ornaments? I just can't. I'll show you them each individually. I just wanted to show them together first. So, these are, this is the Cream Lux lipstick. Okay, here is Sally. This is the Cream Lux lipstick in the shade Sally. You can see it says it right there. I'm gonna try and open it from the bottom because I don't wanna mess these up. I wanna use them. Like, look, you take the lipstick out, and they're still just fine. I can't with this packaging. It's like see-through, kind of. And then you have Sally with some flowers. Mm -mm. Oh. That is a color I will never use, but I will swatch it because of the fact that I'm not getting rid of it. Oh, that is creamy. That is a straight pinky fuchsia color. Looks almost identical to shock. Okay. Also, can we look at the imprints? Skulls and flowers. I shouldn't say imprints, because they're not imprinted. They're popped out on the lipsticks. So, that was Sally. And by the way, all of these lipsticks are still available. You can buy them by themselves for $10 each, or I'm pretty sure... Oh, sorry, my eyes itch and I got concentrated. I want to put my eye out. Or I'm pretty sure they have like a lip bundle that you can buy all three of these together. Next, let's do Boogie. Look at Boogie. I freaking love Boogie. And it's just called Oogie Boogie. It is also a cream luxe lipstick. And all the packaging has the stripes and then that inside. Look at Boogie. Now, I would wear Boogie. Again, same print. Boogie is a pretty color. You guys, these are so creamy. These are so pretty. And creamy, pigmented. There we go. That was Boogie, and last, but most definitely not least, we had Jack and Zero. Love that. And it is Jack Skellington is the name. Yes, Jack Skellington. And they definitely got the rights. They had to pay for the rights to this, so I can't believe it didn't cost more than 115 to be honest. And there's Jack. I'm excited to see what color he is. Is he going to be a red? Yes, sir. And that's a beautiful red. Same print. Oh, I would wear that. Yes, ma'am. We're going to put that on. Let me take this. This is just um, red stain lip bomb from jeffree star you know what let's try them all on why not we'll start with boogie because he's a nude oh okay boogie that is oogie boogie 
That is a beautiful color. That is like a perfect peachy, pinky nude. Or at least on my skin tone. Now we'll do Sally, which is that fuchsia color. Let's do it. There we go. Now keep in mind, these are a cream luxe formula. So they're not matte and they will move. Let's go. Oh, um, oh. Maybe I would wear this. This is Sally. What do you guys think? Sorry about the application, a little, a little wonky, but we're, we're just gonna ignore that. Does not make your teeth look yellow. What do you guys think? Okay, could I rock this? Okay, so that is Sally. And last, we have Jack. Let's do it. And be careful, because Sally was trying to stain me, and she was only on for, like, literally 30 seconds or less. So, uh, be careful with Sally. Now, we have Jack. So, I'll put Jack on with you guys. Let's do it. I want you guys to see how creepy... Look, all I did was touched. Do you see that? Look at that. Excuse me. Wow. Okay, Jack. So that is Jack. So, what do you think? Like I said, I didn't used to be a reds type of person, but uh, I don't know. I've, I've been loving it lately. So there we go. Sally, Boogie, and Jack. We have one thing left. The palette. So the palette by itself is $22. If you want to get it, it is still in stock. You can get the collection. It's still in stock. Like I said, Everything is still in stock except the glitter, which I don't, I don't get it, but okay. So let's look at that packaging. Okay. And it has the soft matte fill as well. Again, it has the same inner, and that's the actual palette. You guys, look at this palette. It looks just like the packaging, and I'm so glad. First impressions. I think, I'm gonna be honest. I think they should have released this collection for Halloween instead of that dumb Hocus Pocus. Because the Hocus Pocus was not it. This was a Halloween palette. Let me know if y'all agree. Okay. And this feels like this is heavy. This is one of the heaviest palettes. One of the heaviest palettes I've ever gotten from them. Look at the mirror. Look at this. So you guys don't get distracted. Look at that. And then look. And then one last look. Do you see it's a snowflake? We have them. Okay. Like this thing is nice. This right here feels almost as heavy as one of their other palettes this size that I got. That are just, you know, the ones they just throw out. That's just the mirror I'm talking about. It looks like we have a duochrome. Frog's Breath, right there. I think that is a duochrome. Almost positive, but let's swatch. This is the first top row. See that glitter from that damn glitter bomb. I didn't get any more on my finger. I'm just rubbing them out because 
I had just tried my hand, so it was a little tacky, I think. There we go. Those are better swatches. And like I said, I didn't get any more. First row. Second row. I told you that was a duo chrome. But you want to know something? It looks just like shock. Or I mean, it looks just like barrel. Maybe. I don't know. Whatever. I wouldn't do the rubbing out right away. Yeah. That looks identical to barrel. No, actually I'm wrong. Because in real life, yeah, it doesn't. But it does look very similar. Last row. Look at that orange. Oh, that's a good orange. Get my fluffy white shirt away from these pigments. That black is a sequel. Sequel? No. That black is a sequin. It is a matte with glitter. Here's what it looks like after being swatched. Doesn't look too much, look at that black. It's hard for you guys to see, but it's like a black that has a lot of purple glitter and a little bit of iridescent glitter. Anyways, it doesn't look like I really swatched it because I was being very careful because I didn't want to get it dirty because I wasn't sure if you could clean this background of it or not. But you can, because I just did it. Okay, so, this is able to be cleaned easily. Now, let me read you the names. From here to here, we have Zero, Meant to Be, Dear Friend, and In My Bones. Now, we're going from here to here. We have Pumpkin Patch, Christmas Town, Frog's Breath, and Dr. Frankenstein. And then the last four. We have, what's this? Sandy Claws. Everybody Scream. And Halloween Town. So, here's the entire ColourPop X Nightmare Before Christmas palette swatched. Don't mind the glitter on that one doesn't come with glitter. That's from that damn glitter pot. I love it. Like, I have nothing bad to say. Like I said, this one is a sequin. I don't know if you guys... Yeah, you can see the glitter a little bit. It is a matte with glitter in it. This one is a duochrome. This is a satin, a matte, a matte, a matte. This is a satin... This is a satin. This is a duochrome. This is a satin. This is a matte. This is a matte. This is a matte. And this is a sequin. If that helps at all. So there we go. Whoa, did you see that? <sighs> so there we go. That is the entire ColourPop X Nightmare Before Christmas collection. So what do you guys think? Was it worth $115? In my opinion, just for the nostalgia of it all, it was worth it to me. And I loved every bit of it. Gorgeous pigment, gorgeous colors. Now, I do wish this color and this color were more different. I mean, they are different. They are. But they're very similar. But other than that, that's the only squawk I have. Packaging was all very adorable. Very well made, a lot of attention to detail. The nostalgia was there. Like, I'm not mad at all of it. Claps, I'm happy. So, let me know what you thought. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and ring that bell because you wanna be in my giveaways. I have a huge one coming for Christmas. Leave me a like if you enjoyed this and please comment down below what you thought. Let me know, did you get this collection? Are you going to get it with the $25 off right now? I don't know how long that lasts, but it is going on. And that's it, lovelies. So I will get out of here. It's been long enough, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.